Rachel Reinstra. You are not a truther. Okay? You are part of the problem. You may have come to YouTube under the guise of exposing chemtrails, but you say nothing that we don't already know. You're almost as bad as Richie with his bringing forth a patent that was seven years old, which I saw about five years ago or so, probably six years ago, when the documentary on YouTube, which I'll leave in the description, or maybe I won't, I don't know if I can find it, but it's not hard to find. If you do want to find it, just search chemtrails, whatever. Anyway, basically anybody, anybody who's vaguely researched chemtrails on YouTube would have seen this documentary. And Richie mentions a patent. Seven years or six years late. Okay? You bring nothing to the table. You have a little bit of jokes and a little bit of fun. A side project to your acting career. All of your videos are copyright protected, and you can strike those people down. Or you can strike those people down whenever you please. But please stop. Stop making out that you're some sort of truther with your chemtrail lung BS, please. Okay. Look what's behind you. That's Prince's bisexual logo. And you're going to go through this video and not mention that? When people are calling you a tranny? I'm not calling you a tranny, tranny, dear. But people are calling you a tranny, aren't they? And you've made sure to get this purple mixed sex logo, the uh, pansexual logo behind you. The same thing that Prince used for his guitar shape, and it's also purple. Subliminal symbology right there, woman. Let's just quickly skip through this video and see if you mention that. So it's laundry night. And, Doing um, the laundry. I'm talking to a lot of friends lately. Didn't um, Zachary, Hub uh, Zachary K. Hubbard um, do a video where he's doing the laundry? I'm pretty sure if you put laundry or doing the laundry, it equals something in Gematria. But uh, maybe I'll save it, save it for another video, perhaps. Who've been frustrated with um, just where they are in life. I'm covering and things I did not know from my favourite prince. And um, feeling kind of scared. When he did die, I would die for this is the 4th month, April. U is the 21st letter of the alphabet. He died on April 21st. Is that a quinky dink? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. See? Okay. So this video is about People Prince. Is angry and People often... <sighs> Oh, people often say about I'm not gonna do much more because her videos are copyrighted, right? So in this video, she's basically talking about symbolism of Prince, but you know, I mean, she's playing dumb. I think that's part of the reason why she's here. She's you know affiliated with Hollywood. Yeah, she's been on, she's been on mainstream TV, and people have said to her, you know, about Hollywood and stuff. Why you why you're not exposing pop stars and stuff like this? So she's here to basically give you a vague. Kind of, hey, oh yeah, I'm just waking up to this. Oh yeah, no. Many of these people, these artists or these Hollywood affiliates, they know full well what's going on. All right. And she doesn't even say very much anyway in this video. I'll tell you what, I'll pause it and I'll watch the video. And then I'll make my comments and see if she actually says anything of any value. I'm going to suspect she doesn't. Notice the way she's wearing sunglasses uh, in my video about the Toronto terror attack. There's a guy there and he's saying, I'm so, I'm so upset. Oh, it was so terrible. Oh, he put, he's wearing sunglasses. So you can't see the emotion on his face. So she's coming here in this video trying to be like, hey, you know, I found out something about my dear friend Prince. Oh, and lots of symbolism and so, oh, lots of symbolic reference. Blah, blah, blah. But she's wearing sunglasses indoors and a black and white hat for your binary right there. Uh, so we're now uh, 
two thirds of the way through and she only said one thing that's anything close to truth, which is um, Prince's death or publicized death on the date of which he did in the song, I will die for you and did the low uh, symbols with the letter U. But uh, yeah, I'll leave it in the description or in the comments come bother to write. Oh, sorry, bother to talk about that now. She's not really saying very much to be honest. She hasn't mentioned the transgender agenda pushing thing and how he was for removing of basically gender, basically, you know. Long story short, he thought he was both male and female, raising that kundalini. But I don't expect this woman here to say anything about it with her black and white hat. Presents duality, especially in the context of the purple and the binary, which I'm talking about. Not much different from the Masons using the black and white checkered floor. So she basically spent a lot of this video banging on about negativity and positivity. People are being negative, people are being positive. Yeah? You gotta be positive all the time. No. Healthy people do have emotions, ups and downs. Yeah, simple as that. To be happy, shappy all the time. Well, let's put it another way. To be like this person, probably spoiled as a child. Yeah, to get everything given to them on the plate, create them basically an asshole. Long story short, the more you give to a young person, the more they don't respect life. But let's not go off, t you know, onto a tangent here. Why? Does she need to fold her laundry in a video? A bit like Zachary K. Hubbard, right? Um, you know, why does she need to do the laundry while doing the video? Is it to try and make herself look more real? Is it more convenient to, to fold your laundry and be on camera? I mean, is it supposed to make her look more real? Hey, look at her, but I'm just folding my laundry. Maybe I'll do a video where I'm folding my laundry. Huh? Give me a break. You know, she's joking about my all oh, my six million a year. I could get somebody to do this for me. Um, yeah, she's going about trolls attacking her and hate and stuff like that. I'm not hating the person. I'm just saying that this person from Hollywood isn't really exposing anything. She doesn't once mention the transgender agenda because she's all for that. She doesn't care. Everyone live and let live. But you know, and she goes on about being a Christian. Yeah, but the transgender or the no more gender society is a mockery of Jesus and God and the Bible because of the Baphomet, which is a goat, which is mockery of where the Bible says that sheep go to heaven, goats go to hell when Jesus separates them from each other. Basically, that's what it's all about, whether you believe it or not. So, yeah, she's wearing a black and white hat, as I've already said which is binary, the most basic form of binary uh, symbol. While talking about prints, I'm not mentioning the trans apocalypse. One of her heroes, she says, playing this clip of Prince. We could play this bit, it doesn't belong to her. When we get too tied down to anything, earth be it a name a body a, a, a lifestyle that's the road to ruin when you get too worried about the human body yeah. and this lifetime and you put too much effort in it in negative sense like fighting someone it's it just keeps you from your goal yeah. so I, uh, I don't bother yes it's the best medicine well, let's play that again ruin. When you get too worried about the human body yeah. and this lifetime and you put too much effort in it in a negative sense, like fighting someone, it's, it just keeps you from your goal. Yeah. So I, uh, I don't bother. Yes, it's the best medicine in the world. Stop worrying about what people say. 
Anyway, so basically, it doesn't mention anything about the trans, um, basically the transgender thing that he was being, you know, made to push, and all the symbolism and stuff like that. You know, do you think he was really that ignorant to it, or is she, you know, do you think she's ignorant to it and just turned the blind eye because it's more pop, she could get more popular and more pro- popularity by getting basically the masses, the sheep who. The sheep pull, the sheep who, the sheep all behind her, which is what she's for. She's no different from Russell Brand coming into the truth movement. Can't be trusted. That's my opinion. Uh, I might wait to upload this until my strikes removed. Because uh, she might not like this video, basically. But there you go.